And we are back once again to Konosuba Fantastic Days. Today we are going to be summoning on the brand new banner, I'll Cure You, Axel's Angel Squad, Recruit Part 3. So this time it's Chris. I have found it weird that they've been wanting to split up the Axel's Angel Squad all like this. Like, why did they just put Erica and Chris on the same banner? So yeah, we're going to be summoning on this one. But I'm also going to kind of summon on this one a little bit. Since it's 500 for the first multi. And this time I am not getting tricked for having high hopes. And getting four multis for cheap. But yeah, I really do like Chris's outfit. I think the like little shorts are much better of a look than the dress slash skirt that most of the other Axel Angel hearts or whatever. I got the Angel Squad mixed up with the Axel hearts. But yeah, her animations are cute. She's ready to fight and she has needles instead of like mini knives or any other like bladed weapon that you would throw. Also, I would have to say, oh, that's also cool that she has wings on her back. Yeah, Chris is one of my favorite side cast members, so I'm always happy to summon for her. Whether it's a legendary unit, forbidden unit, or some kind of random outfit. 145% light physical damage to one enemy. 559% if the enemy is inflicted with haze. 112% light physical damage to one enemy. And 143% if the enemy has a debuff. A moderate boost to agility for all allies. 10 seconds. Plus 126% normal physical damage to one enemy, plus 6% attack when using physical attacks. Is that the most damage I've ever seen? 559 at the enemies afflicted with haze? I'm trying to think who else has a skill like that. Because I don't remember many. Yeah, let's check out her art. I mean, this one's pretty basic. It's not really the usual cute, sexy, or funny art. It's just alright. Like, Chris looks good just opening this window. And you see Amy in the background. But she's fine. But yeah, nothing particularly amazing about this art. The only cool thing is that they're in this clinic place, which has only been introduced during the Axel's Angel Squad events. I do kind of want to know, where did they get this clinic? Like, does one of them own it? Is this a club clinic or something like that? Like, did they just commandeer the Axel's doctor house or clinic, hospital, whatever, just to be able to treat patients? Alright, well, let's get into this. The first one is going to be a group. Oh yeah, I almost summoned on this one. I forgot. I want to go to this, where it's only 500. But alright, if you guys want to join me... Hopefully we all get some luck for this first summon. I don't know if any of the other Axel's Angel Squad are on this banner. Would seem a little early for Erica. But for the other two, I think they should be on this. Alright, twisting my fingers, twisting my arms, twisting my legs, twisting my toes, twisting everything. Come on guys, let's go! Yoko, Bokesha Gilda, 
And looks like I may just have as much luck as I did on Erica's banner. Well, I mean, that's quite a few gold, so... Possibly a chance for a fake out? We believe. I believe in the cause. Come on. Dang. Nothing. Yep, and now it's back to paid ports. I really do hate that they don't specify here that it has to be paid ports. It just literally says like 500, 2,000, 2,000, 3,000. It looks like it'd be regular, but no. All right, let's summon a guaranteed since that multi was disappointing. Still slowly but surely getting rid of these tickets. Very slowly and surely. Alright, this Mia. I'm pretty sure I almost have her duped up. And back to here. Come on, Chris. I want ya. I really do wish all the girls were a little bit more distinct in their outfits. Instead of all of them being an old-timey nurse. Like, Melissa's the only one that's super, super different. Because she's a school nurse or one of those school doctor types from most animes while well, everyone else has that older type nurse outfit now they're all a little distinct in different ways oh wow i didn't even know you could get a fake out on like a three or yeah three star <laughs> i forgot about this art that dust makes boobs on the snowman. God, it's been such a long time since I've seen that art. Yeah, I just want to make sure you guys do have it. But yeah, I didn't remember if you could get it on two star, you could get a fake out. But no, apparently you can. Alright. Let's go here. Well, yeah, I hope you guys had some good luck. I mean, one of the big celebrations should be around the corner. Probably the anniversary. I think think it's within a month or two. I'm not entirely sure for this game's timeline. Since, like, I don't really care that much for metas in this game, I'm like, eh, it's whatever. So I just summon on any of the banners I like. Mostly, I'll summon on story banners, but because the last two banners haven't been story... It's been a little disappointing. Because I really like it when they make cutscenes for banners. Like an extra side story or alternative events of what happens. Like how they get these outfits or other things like that. But they haven't been doing it for the Axel's Angel Squad. Because I guess you just need to go to the event to see how they ended up in these outfits. Alright. Another summon. Let's go. Yo, any more fake outs for me? I mean, possibility. Yeah, I really wonder what the next meta or characters are gonna be. 
Like, are we going to go back to one of the other metas? What's a meta that we haven't seen for a little bit? Is it swimsuits? Uh, maybe they may go holidays because Christmas is around the corner. Also, I did find it so weird that they did Halloween in the beginning of October instead of saving it for halfway or maybe end of October. Alright, let's do our final diamond ticket or rainbow ticket. I really have no idea what this ticket is. Just guaranteed. Man, I can't even get sparking for this. Or sparkling. Ah, uh, yeah, I still love that art of also Cicely. Some of this game has great art. And I just always forget about these cards because there's so many cards in this game. Alright, time for the final multi. I'm twisting everything. Praying to Eris, praying to Aqua. Please, give me. I have summoned. I am wishing for her. She is my favorite girl of the series. And so let's see if I can get her. And you guys, give me your luck too. I'm gonna need it. Damn, I misclicked. Let's go! Come on, don't disappoint me. Like, once again, the Axel's Angel Squad really have not been on my side. For the three banners that have came out so far, I can't believe I got in none- Oh, wait, wait! Oh, is it gonna be her? Please! Ah, it's darkness. I'm pretty sure I already have her completely duped up, since she's super old. She was first year stuff, I'm pretty sure. Dang, that could have been Chris. I hate it here. Uh, damn, that kind of blows. Alright, let's check out the hall. Which of these guys can be used? Oh, so I can still use her. I can use that Cicely. And where is Mia? Alright, I can use all three of them. Oh, wait. And I also got Rin. And I can also use the Rin. Alright, that's good. A bunch of different dupes that I can use. So, that was pretty successful. Yep, not much to say. Like, I didn't get the main unit that I wanted, which was the banner unit. But I guess it's whatever. She'll be back at some other point, and then I'll be excited to get her then. But for now, it was just alright summons. Nothing amazing. Unless, secretly, these guys are like the best card in the game that I've just been sleeping on. But yeah, anyway... I hope you guys enjoyed Konosuba Fantastic Days. And if you guys did, please make sure to follow me on all my social medias like my Twitter, my Twitch, my YouTube, my DLive, my TikTok, my Kick, Rumble, Odyssey, and Daily Motion. Check out my second YouTube channel and like and comment on all my videos. And even join my Discord. There you can stay up to date with everything I choose to do, where my videos, streams, or anything else. But yeah, hope to see you guys next time. Bye.